guys, it's CC. So I've decided to do a bit of a Zelda rant here because I know I haven't made a video in quite some time. And uh, I've been working on a lot of Zelda things lately, so I figured this would be a nice little launch. Hopefully I don't bore you guys to death. Um, so I guess I can start off by saying that Legend of Zelda is one of my all-time favorite games, if you haven't noticed. Um, it's actually the first video game I ever played. came out in 19... 98 Ocarina of Time on the Nintendo 64. I was actually four years old. So as you can assume four years old I wasn't that great at video games, <laughs> but uh, my uncle would help me out with it He most of the time I kind of just watched him play Because I didn't really know what to do and if I did play I kind of just ran around Hyrule Field and uh, I used to love having the horse actually that was my favorite part of it um, But that's only because I didn't know what to do as I got older I played more, um, I asked, started asking my uncle for less and less help, started figuring things out on my own. I replayed that game again on the on the GameCube. My stepdad bought the GameCube version with the Master Quest. And then I replayed it again recently on the Nintendo 3DS. That was beautiful. Anyways, um, from Ocarina of Time, I just kept playing Zelda games. I never got to Majora's Mask up until recently, actually. I'm currently playing it on the Nintendo 3DS. Sorry, I'm a little late on that one. But uh, yeah, I had the GameCube, I had the Wii, I have the Wii U now. So I recently played Hyrule Warriors, which was really fun. Great spin-off. Um, all the characters were so cool to play. I mean, I'm sure there are things I, you know, can complain about, but overall, I enjoyed the game. Um, I'm looking forward to the new Zelda Wii U. Also looking forward to the Twilight Princess HD. Uh, there's always negative things you can say about anything, but there's always positives as well. And I prefer to focus on the positives mostly right now, I guess. Um, but I am looking forward to those games. Uh, recently, this past August, I went to the Goddess of the Symphony over in San Francisco. My uncle, who had the Nintendo 64 and got me playing Ocarina of Time, is actually the same uncle who bought me the tickets and took me to see it so that was pretty cool it was very nostalgic it was a good connection for me and him since you know one of his all-time favorite games and my all-time favorite games is like what brought us together <laughs> I guess you can say no I mean he's family there's tons that brought us together but that's a good connection we have I guess I can always talk to him about Zelda when I went with my uncle to the Symphony of the Goddesses, I actually wanted to dress up as Princess Hilda. And since I couldn't do it then because I was lazy and didn't get the costume in time, I wanted to do it for Halloween. I even have the purple wig in my room, but unfortunately I ended up working Halloween night. Um, but as you can see, I'm blonde. Not entirely, I have a bit of an ombre going on. Bad hair day, so I'm not going to show you. But um, yeah, hopefully I'm going to be full blonde soon see how that looks um and I plan on doing a Linkle cosplay I don't know something for fun maybe even just Link I don't know my own version of a female Link I don't know but anyways um yeah I mean uh Zelda's just I really really have a strong connection to Zelda I even have my player's guide from when I was uh four years old it's falling apart you know look Nintendo 64 I just thought Link was so cool. I mean, that's what stood out to me in when I was four. I mean, I thought Zelda was so pretty and Link was just so cool. So cool. I mean, he is so cool, nonetheless. Um, yeah, I just, I love Zelda. Aside from just that player's guide, I also have, you know, Zelda necklace. This is actually a charm that came with a whole box set of charms Zelda specific charms they're so cool my one of my really really good friends got it for me as a gift um, I also have a room I had a room full of posters sadly I had to take the posters down because I'm remodeling my room I have Zelda manga I have the Hyrule Historia I have Zelda keychains I have an ocarina oh my god I mean if you guys are subscribed to me and have been you guys already know I've done um, Zelda's Lullaby and did it as a remix with my friend Kevin Keja. Um, that was really fun. But yeah, I mean, that was also a gift from the same friend. Uh, it's just, uh, yeah, Zelda is just, I love Zelda. I mean, I, I don't know how else to word it to you guys. I'm sure I've said that like a million times already. But uh, yeah, I just, 
I don't know what else to say. This was supposed to be my Zelda rant. Now I feel like my Zelda rant is dying down because I'm just too excited and too anxious. Um, hopefully I'll be making some newer videos coming up soon. Subscribe if you want to see them. I might attempt a couple Zelda theories. Hopefully they, uh, maybe not because I can't compare to the amazing YouTube theorists that I love. Did I mention them? No, um, I mentioned them in Game Over Jesse's mailbag. Check out Zelda mailbag from Game Over Jesse. I mentioned that I like theories from Commonwealth Realm, McIntyre Productions, Game Over Jesse, Dr. Wily, HMK. I mean, there's just so many out there. I, I spend all my time watching those videos. I could be doing more important things, but, but I just can't because I just can't get enough of Zelda. Either that or I'm on my Tumblr. Um, legend dash of dash sissy at tumblr.com that's not my personal tumblr but that's my zelda tumblr and i'm on there a lot like just blogging zelda fan art because i just love zelda um yeah check it out if you want i guess um all right so subscribe comment if there's anything you guys want me to post anything you guys want me to attempt or try let me know all right bye